Tonight is the night, brother. Tonight is when they realize why we were banished from this world in the first place. And that, my friends, is why Industrial Awesome Incorporated is kicking ass. But Solran, why would we attack such a small town? There can't be more than 500 mortals here. Because, Soltran, the death of these mortals will send a wave of fear through anyone who hears of it. I... I do not understand, Zolran. If we were to first attack a city much larger and much more dense than this one, we could surely send a wave much larger than the one you speak of. Quiet, you! Enough of this bickering. Zoltran, the reason why a small town is such an opportune place for an attack is because they are virtually defenseless. I'm just sick of it. John? What? Business. It's all about the business anymore. That's all there is. There's nothing ethical about business. That's why they call it business. Come on, B. You've had a long day. What do you say we head to the bar, toss a few back while the game's still on? You know what? You're probably right. Probably just working myself more than anything. See, come on now, hey. Turn on the game while it's still on. Get us in the right mindset before we pack up. You got a beautiful wife, Brian. The police, the workers, and any others are all weak. They are no match for the power of which we bestow. And furthermore, once we destroy this city, we will have the masses running scared. When they see us in person, they will surely meet their demise, if not for their panic and anxiety beforehand. Ah, I now see why we must extirpate the weakest fleshies first, to secure our victory when we wage war with the common herd. Indeed, Zoltran, you do. But now, it is no longer time for discussion. Tonight is the night for action. Now, Brett, quit your blabber, and I want to hear the game. We now interrupt your previously scheduled bulletin to bring you this important message. Attention! Attention! To any and all who are hearing this right now! Millville has been invaded! We do not know what the enemy is, but we do know one thing! They are not human! Oh, sweet baby Jesus! Oh, didn't know the circus was in town. Fags. Oh, oh what? Oh my god! <laughs> Everyone must evacuate immediately! If we don't leave right now, we are sure to... Yeah, that's all, folks. What? What do we do now, Brent? What can't we do? There's only one thing to do, Troy. Brent! We don't even know what these things are! We don't know what they're capable of! Hell, he just said they ain't human! Troy! There's only one thing we can do, and that's to go out there and find out what we can about these freaks. Hopefully they'll still be here so we can give them a fight. Brent? For victory! Brent? God damn it, Brent! Stay together, we can't afford to lose anybody. We ain't losing.
isn't anybody, Shook. Don't you worry. I'm probably gonna bite you. Time to die, motherfuckers. Let's wipe the floor with these scumbags. What the heck's going on? Try now! Halt! Try! Get back inside. This one's mine. I said get inside! Brand, look out! No! Take a hand at your backside, Shug. It's coming right for you. The name is Brent. Brent America. What should we do now, mighty Zoran? These fleshies are much more powerful than we thought. Yes, we must regroup. I think they are expecting our arrival. No, Zoran, we can't let them escape. Oh, and why is that? If the rest of the fleshies hear of Deitus' demise, they will know They that will what? They will know that we are virtually- Shh! That one's listening. They will know that we are I know they will defensive. know that. I don't want them to know that. So I told you not to say it. But we need to get inside. We don't have much time. We'll set up camp here tonight. Figure this all out in the morning.